Howdy, howdy. Welcome to Media Cafe, episode four. We are your hosts, Mac, Jack. And I'm Chris. So, uh, fellas, how's your weekend going? It's pretty or good. Go? Pretty good. Pretty yeah. good, yeah, and pretty um, uneventful. I know, it's, a lot of stuff it's happened. the first episode since the Blazer Media rebuild. We, yeah, yeah, revamp. Yeah, yeah revamp, so we're, brand. we're kicking it off. I know. So. Yeah, it's going to be good. I th- uh, we got we got Media Cafe on Monday. Um, I don't know, Tuesday, Wednesday. Sound check on Tuesday with Pretty sure, yeah. uh, Alex and Joey. Or no, 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 not Alex. Braden, I think. Yeah, so. Braden yeah, and Joey. Yeah, yeah, that's right, yeah. that's right. So that's going to be all about music. And then, and then on Wednesday we got, like, I believe it's sports. So with a heart. That's and Alex Hart and mm-hmm. then Joey Donahue. Mm-hmm. And then Thursday, Thursday. is... Colin, Colin yeah. and then like us and like that a bunch good. of other people That's, yeah, like all spoofing thing. stuff. Yep. Uh, like and movie trailers. And yeah. then Friday is Fun Fact Friday, I think we'll call yeah. it. Fun Faculty Fun Fact, Fact Friday. Fun Faculty Friday. Friday. That's uh, what yeah. Whatever. I don't know. Fun Faculty Fun Fact Faculty Friday. Friday. Yeah. Fact Fact pre- With Friday. With Sarah Friday. and Faculty, uh, I Caitlin. Caitlin. Yeah. Yes. And they yeah they are doing that. So our, we got our whole like we got an organized schedule now. Yep. It's yeah. all it's all clean. It's all set up. No more morning announcements. No yeah, more morning announcements. You don't have to get that school message anymore. <laughs> but um, yeah, so it's been quite a bit of time since we've had an episode. So we had we, uh, we had some stuff come out. Yeah, yeah. the Irishman. One. The Irishman. The Irishman. I read the book for that. Oh really? I, I know nothing about I, it. I should say I read it. I should say I skimmed it. Houses. I heard you paint houses. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I do my own carpentry. Yep. Yeah. I know that like, Robert De Niro is de-aged. That's about it. <laughs> yeah, a lot of them are de-aged. Al Pacino. Yeah. yeah. Uh, what's his face? From Goodfellas and Home Alone. Yeah. Joe Pesci. Yeah, Joe Pesci. Yeah, mm. yeah what a legend. Joe Pesci. I haven't watched it yet. Um, all the either. way through. But, wow, what a movie. Like, Good, really? three, three and a half hours. Movie of, of the year? No. No. <laughs> Like, I mean, it's Netflix just a great, movie. Of like the year. personally, no, but like it's just a really good like Scorsese classic. He's one of the best yeah. directors to yeah. ever exist. And like this is probably the last like movie he's going to direct. I, I mean, he's not getting any younger, and this was <laughs> yeah. like a big movie. Yeah. Like it's got De Niro, Pacino, Pesci. It pulled names. Keitel, pulled names. like wow. Yeah, no. Uh, that's like that's just like wow. I don't, I don't, I definitely watch it just because it's probably not going to yeah. happen ever again. Like no. the end of an era kind of a movie. What's but, really interesting though is The Irishman came out and I think a week later or two weeks ago, I forget which, like when it happened, but someone came out and they said that they knew where, uh, I forget his name, the guy who died. Yeah, Hoffa's body was. And it was completely off of everything that the I Heard Japan Houses. Um, the killer, um, Frank Sheeran. Yeah, Frank Sheeran's like whole thing, it threw it all off. So they're gonna go. They're gonna go investigate the place that he said it was. And if they're right, everything in the Irishman is disproved. Oof. Yeah. Well, <laughs> it came out right after the movie, so I'm assuming that it's just someone trying to carry with the hype. But probably. I heard so the movie's pretty accurate out. though. Was yeah. there a scene in the movie that you like really liked, like? No. Like, I, I don't, like, no, I mean, the de-aging is weird. Really? Like, you can, like, I don't know how to You can tell? Like, obviously you can tell. Well, you know like, if you, yeah, if you put a picture of Al Pacino when he was young and Al Pacino oh, yeah, de-aged, it, would it, would look diff- it looks different. Yeah, but, I think the most yeah. impressive one was Samuel L. Jackson and Captain Marvel. That, that was really, incredible. That was pretty impressive. It but was like, I, I don't know. I, I just find de aging so like fascinating. It's like such an interesting making, thing. Yeah. I know they're making a movie. I forget the movie star. He's dead now. But yeah, the Vietnam movie. Yeah. Yeah. They're, <laughs> the <laughs> actor who passed away is going to be in a movie. That's, yeah. Yeah, that's crazy. But no, nah, I I I, st- I want to finish it before like I like make any definitive like. Yeah. I, I don't know. I don't really have a favorite scene because I haven't seen the whole thing. Yeah. Like, yeah, I, yeah. I, like, I don't, like, I only watched, like, a little bit of it. Mm-hmm. But, um, like, overall, though, like, I recommend it I, so far. I got to watch that. Yeah, my parents, like, said it, it was really good. Like, yeah. so, like and there's, like, uh, a thing of, like, all them talking, like, about the movie and just stuff, like, stuff in mm. general. Like, 30 minutes, which is cool. Yeah. 
my brother who recommended the book to me said that it was w- probably one of his favorite books next to like 1984 oh, wow. which is his favorite that's awesome 1984 yeah. is a great yeah. book that's a, that's really a classic book, yeah. I'm surprised that we don't read that it's cool yeah, we, we should, honestly should instead of Fahrenheit it's, really, re- it's yeah. really relevant yeah it is mm-hmm. like gaming wise also big news oh, the next Resident yes. Evil yeah. game yes Resident, Resident Evil, Evil 3, 3 remake. Biohazard? No, that's oh. that's just what it's that's... called in Japan. It's called Biohazard oh, okay. and then like RE3 or RE2. Oh, okay. I'm very excited. I, I'm not a big fan of like the Resident Evil series, but I loved RE2 remake. Yeah, RE2 is great. Like, wow. What but game, I heard RE3 is like even more scarier because there's like the nemesis. Yeah, nemesis is going to make your life a lot less enjoyable yeah, I know. compared to Mr. X. Yeah. Oh man, what a doozy. He's going to be blowing <laughs> you up, grabbing you through walls, the whole lot, the whole lot. It's going to be Remind fun. Remind me, does this still follow Leon? No. No? no? Okay. Jill Valentine Jill. from One. Okay. And so on. Mm. But like, wow. I did not see that coming. I just go on like Reddit and it was like <laughs> RE3 leaked. Like, on like, here it is. <laughs> yeah, like leak, RE3 leaked on PSN. Official like key art is on servers. I was just like, <laughs> it oh, came out of nowhere. It really did. Uh, yeah, there was nothing like preloading like, it. Oh wow! Like Halo came out on PC yesterday. And I don't get what like, the big deal about that means. Well, like, Halo Reach coming out on PC. Yeah. Halo hasn't Halo, been on PC since yeah. 2007. Oh, really? Yeah, and Halo Reach is notoriously the best Halo game. Mm-hmm. Yeah, pretty pretty yeah. much. Oh, like, Halo Reach. Yeah, Halo Reach is great, but like it's just the start of like. The second yeah. golden age of Halo, I think. Mm. There's yeah. like so many people playing Halo again. Since Halo, um, Master Chief Collection. Yeah, that's it's kind of on an uphill trend. Yeah, they're finally like bringing it back together and everything. Yeah. It's like and Halo Infinite's just gonna. Pieces. I hope. I that's... want it. I don't want it to fail. I know. I, I do think... not want that. Game I thought to fail. that. Reach was like the peak. Then Halo Four started to go down. I did not Halo like Four. Four only went down a little bit. Five is just like when yeah, they so, dropped off. Like yeah, yeah. so cliff. it's like Halo Halo One comes out and it's on an uphill trend. Two, Halo Halo Three, Halo three <laughs> and then it shoots up it's exponential. Reach. And then Reach like, says break the graph. And then yeah. four brings it down back to the graph, and five just like tanked it back to where it was. Yeah, before. start like four and just five. The, collection, the collection's one. bringing it up. <laughs> five yeah. was just like woo, goodbye. Yeah. Down the to the negative. Yeah, it went back. It went to the nether, dude. Yeah. And infinite is really gonna. But it better be good. Re three might get announced at the video game awards. Yep, coming up. They, might, yep. The game yeah. awards mm-hmm. December twelfth. I think that's next Thursday. I'm definitely tuning in. I'll tune in. Like, I'll tune in. <laughs> Last year, like the uh, Mortal Kombat guy announced. That was awesome. Yeah, I was. All right. cool. that was I don't. Cool. I'm not a big cool Mortal Kombat guy, but that trailer with um, Immortal by Twenty One Savage or right? that it was, was incredible. That was cool. <laughs> that was cool. I'll get it. That. That was I was like, yeah, I like sure. Mortal like, Kombat. It was like best racing game, and all of a sudden you just see the kunai, so <laughs> yeah. the kunai go fly yeah. through. <laughs> I was like, I was like, uh, <laughs> and then it just like went to a trail. I was like. What is this? All right, like, <laughs> sweet. Like, I was like, best racing game. And, like, all of a sudden, like... Was RE2 announced at the Game Awards? I don't know. I no, don't no, 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 it wasn't. No, it EA was announced at E3, right? EA, E3 2018, they had, like, this, like, um, the perspective of a rat. And, like, yeah, 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 I remember that. Yeah. Like and then at the that. very end, you just see the, the ultimate life Leon. form, Leon Scott Kennedy. He's <laughs> just, like, vibing, looking at the screen. I was, yeah. my, like, my eyes, like, popped out of my head. Like, <laughs> my, like a cartoon. Yeah, I was like. just like, I was like, Leon. <laughs> yeah. So, what are the chances that the fifth Smash DLC character gets announced? Oh, very high. Oh, yeah. considering it comes out in February, yeah. very high. Yep. Very high. Who do you think it's going to be? <laughs> Phoenix Wright. Phoenix, right? Phoenix what are you right. gonna do? What are you gonna do before you <laughs> meet up? Objection! Like, <laughs> you die. Yeah. What about like Minecraft Steve? I could totally. I heard. I heard, I heard, I heard that. Freddy Fazbear. Really? Because no. they released. I would cry. I'm gonna cry. Released five minutes at Freddy's one through like six on Switch like the other day. Oh, they did. Yeah. Oh. Oh, <laughs> that would suck. Uh, I'm Phoenix, right? Please. Lonnie has not left me alone for this. <laughs> but he thinks that it's gonna be Dante. Yeah, he really because wants Devil it to May be Cry Dante. Three comes out in February. He really wants it to be Dante. It, it's not happening. Sorry, Chief. As much as I would love that, I it's know. not happening. He was talking about that last year. Like, yeah, 
Yeah, like exactly. when they announced that there will be DLC characters, he was like, "One of them's Neo or Don." Wait, so they they ex like added more DLC characters, right? They're going oh, to. Uh, after, so five's the last pack. one of the pack. Yeah, but they're doing another pack. There's going to be a DLC pack too. <laughs> yeah, right. and then another five. Yeah. Like... and there's nothing confirmed on that, so it might be characters from returning That's games. It's crazy. This yeah. one's all brand new games. Yeah, nice. we don't know about two. Yeah. It could two, be a mix. two could be like new characters yeah. and returning. Yeah, it could be so whatever. we could see more from. More Mario characters. Oh, oh. we need all. Yeah. No thanks. But Smash is also in contention for Game of the Year. It is. Yep. Yeah. What it's do you think? There. Speaking of Game of the Year, what do you think is going to win? I don't think Smash should win. <laughs> it if, if shouldn't. It, if it, it shouldn't. It, it's the same. Okay, it's a good game, but like, it's the same game. Like, it's been the, like, for a while. I, I think like it should either be <laughs> re R2 remake. <laughs> <laughs> I told him that you. Or, yeah. um, or I'm not saying it won't win. I'm just it saying shouldn't. it shouldn't. <laughs> I, okay, I I can agree with you. Like yeah. remakes, it's like it's a come totally on, different yeah. game like, though. I feel like I'm kind of biased just because of like it is like in no way like a the remaster, and like, it is like the epitome I, I it. of I a remake. I'm just like, assuming it's called yeah. Resident Evil Two. Yeah. Which was already a it thing. already had and it's basically all that all that content pushed out again plus new content which makes sense it's fine it's fair yeah but it's still the old content yeah but like it's just like it took the all it really took was the like the skeleton of the game like the story mm -hmm. and just put it into Captain Am like a Captain America body like yeah. I was like it I I don't know man like. I can't play RE2 like from 1998 anymore because yeah. the new one just took that game and like beat it into submission. <laughs> yeah. and was like I am RE2. <laughs> like <laughs> go away. So um <clears throat> what do you what do you think is the second place then? Uh probably like what's up for game of the year again? I think control mm -hmm. is up there. Death oh, Stranding. No, no. Sekiro. Nope. I know. Neither nope. of those. Death, Sekiro is not playing. Sekiro is not playing. Nope. I love Sekiro. Sekiro is a good game, but Sekiro it's just be hard. For game of the year. It's like, no. So, I guess Smash or RE2 for me. I guess. Basically, yeah, that's what... Here. Yeah. All the other games. Devil May Cry 5 should be up for game of the year. But, <clears> yeah, that's Jeff fair. Keighley, Devil May Cry is very good. Jeff Keighley's like, <gasps> Death Strike. Wait, does he <laughs> choose what's... Uh, well, considering so he Twitter created the Game nice. Awards, I'm pretty sure yeah. he has some, like, leverage. Yeah, let's check Twitter. Jeff Keighley, like, runs the show. He, like, coordinates how it runs. I don't know about nominations, but, like, he, used he to sets be on it Spike. the whole... Yeah, <coughs> he's been around for a while. Like, I respect the guy, but, like, I feel like he's kind of biased towards mm. Kojima. Yeah. With all yeah. the Death Stranding stuff. Speaking of which, he just came up in the Who to Follow for the Game Awards right. page. Yeah, because he, he, like, he created it. I remember the one year Todd Howard came out with a bunch of, like... Monks. Oh, the, um, yeah. way back, like 2010. Oh, yeah. And you just see Todd Howard and he does a yeah, he's, just, like, he's, he's wearing a leather, leather jacket. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's just like. So, uh, the... new Elder Scrolls game. Yeah, <laughs> six. Yeah, oh, yeah. Let's talk about that. No. Yeah. Point, but, no that's Coming like, out 2025. It's yeah. like the seventh season of Media, Media Cafe. Caf Media Cafe yeah. 20. We'll Hi, talk about yeah, that. Yeah, we'll be back. <laughs> In we'll record years. another episode after we graduate college. Yeah, we'll be like in working jobs by the time that comes. Hey, <laughs> maybe someone else carries our show. No way. I don't want someone else to. Yeah, <laughs> no, no one will. Well, Media Cafe dies uh, after With our year. graduation. Yeah. Come on, Chris. Sit down something. with us. We can look up on it. It's fine. Where are they? Best performance? I found that. Scored music. Uh, continuous games, narrative. What is it? Oh, for, for what? Game of the Year. I'm getting there. Not there Come on! Game Direction nominee, fresh indie developer, best fighting game, Jump Force. Um, Esports player. No. <laughs> uh, so, uh, who do you think is going to win player. best esports? <laughs> uh, art Direction, content creator. Where is it? Game of the Year. Okay. Control, Death Stranding, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, Resident Evil 2, Sekiro is up there, Sekiro and win. The Outer Worlds. Sekiro should win. No, it's, the only problem with Sekiro is wow, a great game, but 
It's yeah. too hard it's, for people to play. It is <laughs> pretty Get hard. better at video games. Yeah, get better, scrub. Oh, yeah, like, don't die to the it's chicken. It's not like Jedi Fallen. Don't die to the chicken. I didn't die to the chicken. Good. It's not like Je- Jedi Fallen Order where you can choose your difficulty. You only have one difficulty. You shouldn't need a difficulty. Exactly. There's no difficulty. No I sense. always pick the hardest difficulty in video games because I feel if you're not playing on the hardest difficulty, you are not playing the game. You're not truly you are experiencing not it. <laughs> yeah. right. I think we're out of time, fellas. So this oh, is yikes. yeah. This <laughs> is the end of episode four. We are your hosts, Mac, Jack, and I'm Chris, and we'll see you all later.